five multiples and factors points to learn multiples tests of divisibility prime and composite numbers prime factorization highest common factor lowest common factor review exercise 1 choose the correct answer Two, state yes or no. Three, find the factors. Multiples The product of two or more numbers is a multiple of the numbers that are multiplied. Example 7 into 4 is equal to 28. 28 is a multiple of 7 and 4. 6 into 7 is equal to 42. 42 is a multiple of 6 and 7. 9 into 8 is equal to 72. 72 is a multiple of 9 and 8. Properties of multiples Property 1 The smallest multiple of a number is the number itself. Property 2 Every number is a multiple of 1 and itself. Property 3 Every multiple of a number is equal to or greater than the number. Property 4 There are infinite multiples of a given number. Property 5 the multiple of given numbers are always even. Property 6 The multiples of an odd number are alternatively odd and even numbers. Common multiples A number that is a multiple of two or more numbers is called a common multiple of those numbers. Example Find the common multiples of 3 and 5. Multiples of 3 3 6 9 12 15 18 21 24 27 30 Multiples of 5 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Common multiples of 3 and 5 are 15, 30, so on. Factors a factor of a given number is another number which divides the given number without leaving any remainder. Example 15 divided by 3 is equal to 5. 3 is a factor of 15. 24 divided by 4 is equal to 6. 4 is a factor of 24. 36 divided by 6 is equal to 6. 6 is a factor of 36. 
properties of factors property 1 1 is a factor of every number property 2 1 is the smallest factor of every number property 3 the largest factor of a number is the number itself property 4 the factor of a number is smaller than or equal to the number property 5 every number has at least two factors that is one and the number itself common factors a number that is a factor of two or more numbers is called a common factor of those numbers example find the common factors of 18 and 20 to find the common factors let us first find the factors of 18 and 20 factors of 18 are 1 2 3 6 9 and 18 factors of 20 are 1 2 4 5 10 and 20 common factors of 18 and 20 are 1 and 2 1 write the first 5 odd multiples of each of the numbers given below. Two, write the first five multiples of each of the numbers given below. Three, write four multiples of the following numbers lying between 30 and 70. Four, write the first five even multiples of each of the numbers given below. Five. Write two common multiples of the numbers given below. Tests of divisibility. Tests of divisibility help us to quickly find if a number is completely divisible by another number without actually dividing it. Divided by 2 A number is divisible by 2 if its last digit is 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. Example 10 502 8314 4856 3658 Divisibility by 3 A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digits is divisible by 3. Example A 
39 is divisible by 3 as 3 plus 9 is equal to 12 and 12 is divisible by 3. B. 5010 is divisible by 3 as 5 plus 0 plus 0 is equal to 6 and 6 is divisible by 3. C. 6410 is not divisible by 3 as 6 plus 4 plus 1 plus 0 is equal to 11 and 11 is not divisible by 3. Divisibility by 4 If the last two digits of a number taken together are divisible by 4, then the number is divisible by 4. Example A. 1712 Last two digits are 12 and 12 is divisible by 4. Therefore, 1712 is divisible by 4. B. 7125 Last two digits are 25 and 25 is not divisible by 4. Therefore, 7125 is not divisible by 4. Divisibility by 5 A number is divisible by 5 if its last digit is either 0 or 5. Example A. 80 is divisible by 5 as the last digit is 0. B. 395 is divisible by 5 as the last digit is 5. Divisibility by 6 If a number is divisible by 2 and 3 both, then the number is divisible by 6 also. Example 5280 is divisible by 2 as the last digit is 0. 5280 is also divisible by 3 as 5 plus 2 plus 8 plus 0 is equal to 15 and 15 is divisible by 3. Since 5280 is divisible by 2 and 3 both it is divisible by 6 also. Divisibility by 7 If you double the last digit of a number and subtract it from the rest of the number or vice versa and if the number is 0 or a number divisible by 7 then the given number is divisible by 7. Example A. 672 Double of the last digit 2 is 4. Subtracting 4 from 67 we get 67 minus 4 is equal to 63. 63 is divisible by 7. Therefore, 672 is also divisible by 7. B. 497 double of the last digit 7 is 14. Subtracting 14 from 49 minus 14 is equal to 35. 35 is divisible by 7. Therefore, 35 is divisible by 7. Divisibility by 8 If the last 3 digits of a number taken together are divisible by 8, then the number is divisible by 8. Example A. In 5,4968, the number formed by the last 
three digits is 968 and 968 is divisible by 8. Therefore, 5,4968 is divisible by 8. B. 4,57501 is not divisible by 8 because the number formed by the last three digits is 501 and 501 is not divisible by 8. Divisibility by 9 A number is divisible by 9 if the sum of its digits is divisible by 9. Example A. 72 is divisible by 9 as 7 plus 2 that is the sum of its digits is 9 and it is divisible by 9. B. 576 is divisible by 9 as 5 plus 7 plus 6 is 18. 18 is divisible by 9. C. 517 is not divisible by 9 as 5 plus 1 plus 7 is 13 which is not divisible 9. Divisibility by 10 A number is divisible by 10 if its last digit is 0. Example A. 90 is divisible by 10 as the last digit is 0. B. 5480 is divisible by 10 as the last digit is 0. C. 6090 is divisible by 10 as the last digit is 0. Divisibility by 11 for a number to be divisible by 11, the difference of the sum of the alternate digits of the number should be either 0 or a multiple of 11. Example 3223 is divisible by 11. 3223 sum of alternate digits is 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 and 2 plus 3 is equal to 5. Their difference is 5 minus 5 is equal to 0. Therefore, 3223 is divisible by 11. Example 13,244 is divisible by 11. 13,244 sum of alternate digits is 1 plus 2 plus 4 is equal to 7 and 3 plus 4 is equal to 7. Their difference is 7 minus 7 is equal to 0. Therefore, 13,244 is divisible by 11. 1. Color the numbers which are divisible by 3 with a pink crayon. Color the numbers which are divisible by 5 with a red crayon. 3. Prime and Composite Numbers Prime Numbers any number greater than 1 which has only two factors 
that is 1 and the number itself is called a prime number. Example 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 are prime numbers. Composite numbers Any number which is more than two factors is called a composite number. Example 4, 6, 8, 9, 12 are composite numbers. Twin primes Two prime numbers with a composite number in between are called twin primes. Example 3 and 5 are twin primes. 11 and 13 are twin primes. Co-primes Two numbers are said to be co-primes if they have only one as their common factor. Example 3 and 4 are co-primes. 4 and 9 are co-primes. 21 and 25 are co-primes. Prime factorization All composite numbers can be expressed as the products of their prime factors. The writing of composite numbers as the product of their prime factors is called prime factorization. This can be done in two ways. Factor tree method In this method, we factorize a composite number till we get all its prime factors. Example Factorize 56 using the factor tree method. Solution Therefore, prime factorization of 56 is 2 into 2 into 2 into 7. Example Factorize 108 using the factor tree method. Therefore, the prime factorization of 108 is 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 3. Division method In this method, we start dividing the given number by the smallest prime number and continue the division by prime numbers till we reach 1. Hint Make use of the tests of divisibility to divide the number. Example Find the prime factorization of 340 by the division method. Solution 340 divided by 2 170 170 divided by 2 85 85 divided by 5 17 17 divided by 17 1 therefore the prime factorization of 340 is 2 into 2 into 5 into 17 1 find the prime factors of each of the following numbers using the factor tree method.
टू फाइंड द प्राइम फैक्टर्स ऑफ ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग नंबर्स बाय द डिविजन मेथड Three, fill in the blanks. Highest common factor, HCF. The greatest or the highest number, which divides two or more numbers exactly without leaving any remainder, is called the highest common factor of these numbers. In short. It is written as HCF. HCF of two or more numbers can be found by any of the following methods. HCF by listing factors. In this method, we list all the factors of the given numbers. From the list, we select the highest common factor. Example. Find the HCF of 15 and 30 by listing the factors. Solution: Factors of 15: 1, 2, 3, 5, 15. 15. Factors of 30: 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Fifteen, thirty. Common factors: one, three, five, fifteen. Highest common factor HCF is equal to fifteen. Therefore, HCF of fifteen and thirty is fifteen. HCF by prime factorization in this method we find the prime factors of given numbers and then list all the common prime factors the product of all the common prime factors will give the hcf example find the hcf of 42 and 162 by prime factorization solution let us find the prime factors of 42 and 162 42 divided by 2 21 21 divided by 3 7 7 divided by 7 1 162 2 81 81 divided by 3 27 27 divided by 3 9 9 divided by 3 3 3 divided by 3 1 prime factorization of 42 is equal to 2 into 3 into 7 prime factorization of 162 is equal to 2 into 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 common prime factors is equal to 2 and 3 therefore hcf of 2 into 3 is equal to 6 therefore hcf of 42 and 162 is 6 HCF by division. Example: Find the HCF of 35 and 95 by division. Solution: Divide the bigger number 95 by the smallest number 35. The remainder 25 becomes the divisor for the first divisor 35. Divide again. The next remainder ten 
becomes the divisor for the previous divisor. 25. Divide again. The remainder 5 becomes the divisor for the previous divisor. 10. Divide again. We get 0 as the remainder. The last divisor 5 is the HCF. Therefore, HCF of 35 and 95 is 5. HCF of 3 numbers HCF of 3 numbers is found in the same way as we find the HCF of 2 numbers. Example Find the HCF of 28, 56 and 84 by factor method. Solution Factors of 28 1, 2, 4, 7, 14, 28 Factors of 56 1, 2, 4, 7, 8, 14, 28, 56 Factors of 84 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 12, 14, 21, 28, 42, 84 Common factors of 28, 56 and 84 are 1, 2, 4, 7 and 28 But the common highest factors is 28. HCF of 28, 56 and 84 is 28. Example Find the HCF of 22, 33 and 66 by prime factorization. Solution Let us find the prime factors of 22, 33 and 66. Prime factorization of 22 is equal to 2 into 11. Prime factorization of 33 is equal to 3 into 11. Prime factorization of 66 is equal to 2 into 3 into 11. Common prime factor of 22, 33 and 66 is 11. Therefore, HCF of 22, 33 and 66 is 11. Example Find the HCF of 8, 12 and 30 by division. Solution 1. Find the HCF of any two numbers first, 8 and 12. 2. The HCF of 8 and 12 will be the divisor for the third number, 30. Therefore, HCF of 8, 12 and 30 is 2. Properties of HCF Property 1 The HCF of two or more numbers is the greatest of their common factors. Property 2 The HCF of the given composite numbers is always smaller than the given numbers. Property 3 If one number is a factor of another number, then the smaller number is the HCF. Property 4 The HCF of two co-prime numbers is always 1. 1. Find the HCF of each of the following group of numbers by division.
2. Find the HCF of each of the following group of numbers by listing all their factors. Three. Find the HCF of each of the following group of numbers by prime factorization. Lowest common multiple LCM The smallest number that can be divided by two or more given numbers without leaving any remainder is called the lowest common multiple or least common multiple of those numbers. In short, it is written as LCM. LCM of two or more numbers can be found by the following methods. LCM through listing multiples. Example Find the LCM of 8, 12, and 24 by listing their multiples. Solution Multiples of 8 is equal to 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48. Multiples of 12 is equal to 12. 24, 36, 48, 60. Multiples of 24 is equal to 24, 48, 72, 120. The first common multiple of 24. Therefore, LCM of 8, 12 and 24 is 24. LCM by prime factorization. In this method, we first list all the prime factors of the numbers and then multiply the common prime factors with the remaining prime factors to get the LCM. Example Find the LCM of 20 and 84 by prime factorization method. Solution 20 divided by 2 10 10 divided by 2 5 5 divided by 5 1 84 divided by 2 42 42 divided by 2 21 21 divided by 3 7 7 divided by 7 1 Find the prime factors Circle the common factors. Prime factorization of 20 is equal to 2 into 2 into 5. Prime factorization of 84 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 7. Common prime factors of 20 and 84 are 2 into 2. Therefore, LCM is equal to 2 into 2 into 5 into 3 into 7 is equal to 4 into 15 into 7 is equal to 420. Therefore, LCM of 20 and 84 is equal to 420. Multiply the common factors by the prime factors that are not common in this example the common prime factors 2 and 2 are multiplied with uncommon prime factors 5 3 7 lcm by common division in this method we divide the given numbers by the common prime factors till the last row contains no common prime factor or till we get 1. Example Find the LCM of 48 and 64 by common division. Solution 
divide by the smallest common prime factor. Bring down the number that cannot be divided further. Continue the division by the smallest possible common factor till the last row consists of no common factor or consists of only one. Multiply all the prime factors to get the LCM. Therefore, LCM of 48 and 64 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 is equal to 4 into 4 into 4 into 3 is equal to 16 into 12 is equal to 192 LCM of 3 numbers LCM of 3 numbers is found in the same way as we find LCM of 2 numbers Example Find the LCM of 2, 4 and 5 by listing the multiples Solution Multiples of 2 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, so on. Multiples of 4 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, so on. Multiples of 5 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 The first common multiple of 20 Therefore, LCM of 2, 4 and 5 is 20 Example Find the LCM of 8, 12 and 30 by prime factorization Solution Find the prime factors of 8, 12 and 30. Multiply the common prime factors that is 2, 2 and 3 once with the prime factors that are not common that is 2, 2 and 3. 8 is equal to 2 into 2. 12 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3. 30 is equal to 2 into 3 into 5. Therefore, LCM of 8, 12 and 30 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 is equal to 8 into 15 is equal to 120. Example Find the LCM of 15, 25 and 30 by common division. Solution Divide the smallest common prime factor. Bring down the number that cannot be divided as it is. Continue the division by the smallest common prime factor till the last row consists of one or no common prime factor. Therefore, LCM of 15, 25 and 30 is equal to 5 into 3 into 5 into 2 is equal to 15 into 10. Therefore, LCM of 15, 25 and 30 is equal to 150. Properties of LCM Property 1 the LCM of two or more numbers cannot be less than the given numbers. Property 2 If out of two given numbers, one number is a factor of another, then the greater number is the LCM of the given numbers. Property 3 The LCM of two co-prime numbers is their product. 
1. Find the LCM of each of the following group of numbers by common division. the LCM of each of the following group of numbers by listing their multiples. 3. Find the LCM of each of the following group of numbers by prime factorization. 2. Relationship between LCM and HCF Example Let us find the HCF and LCM of 24 and 32. Solution LCM HCF Therefore, LCM is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 is equal to 96. 24 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3. 32 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. Therefore, XCF is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 is equal to 8. Let us find the product of the HCF and LCM of these two numbers. HCF and LCM is equal to 8 into 96 is equal to 768. Let us now find the product of the given numbers. Product of the given number is equal to 24 into 32 is equal to 768. We notice the following relationship. Product of HCF into LCM of two given numbers is equal to product of the given numbers. From the above relationship, we can say HCF is equal to product of two numbers divided by LCM. LCM is equal to product of two numbers divided by HCF. Unknown number is equal to HCF into LCM divided by known number. Example The LCM and the HCF of two numbers is 144 and 12. Respectively, if one of the numbers is 36, find the other number. Solution HCF into LCM is equal to product of two numbers. 12 into 144 is equal to unknown number into 36. Therefore, unknown number is equal to 12 into 144 divided by 36 is equal to 48. Example The product of two numbers is 756. If their HCF is 6, find their LCM. Solution HCF into LCM is equal to product of two numbers. 6 into LCM is equal to 756. Therefore, LCM is equal to 756 divided by 6 is equal to 126. So, if out of four values, that is, two numbers, LCM and HCF, any three are given to us, the fourth one can be found out. 1. The HCF of 72 and 168 
is 24. Find their LCM. Two. The product of two numbers is 720. If their LCM is 80, find their HCM.